Most liver cancer is secondary or metastatic, meaning it started somewhere else in the body. Primary liver cancer, which starts in the liver, accounts for about 2% of cancers in the U.S. Most people don't experience signs or symptoms in the early stages. Although it's vitally important and you can't live without your liver, you can remove up to 80% of a normal liver safely with low mortality rates and the liver will actually grow back to normal size. Surgical oncologist Mark Bloomston says this regenerative ability opens the opportunity for advanced treatment techniques like newly developed stage procedures involving chemotherapy. We can put radioactive beads into the liver. We can do procedures to trick the liver into thinking it already had surgery so the good side will start to grow in advance so we can take out more liver at the time of surgery. In the coming decades, doctors hope the number of liver cancer cases in this country will drop. Hepatitis C is a driving force behind this disease, which is also impacted by alcoholic cirrhosis and morbid obesity. These are lifestyle issues which can be addressed through awareness. Until then, advanced techniques offer the best chance for a cure. So if you can at least increase the number of patients eligible for curative therapies, by definition, you're going to get more cures. In general, survival rates are higher for people who can have surgery to remove their cancer, regardless of the stage. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.